Hey guitar buddies, let's have a look at Gimme Some Lovin'. Now it was originally done by the Spencer Davis group, but the version I'm doing is the Blues Brothers cover, which is in E, the original is in G. Okay, but this has got a little more guitar on, so I thought I'd do this version. Okay, uh, it's a very simple riff to start off, very effective. We've just got an octave E. <laughs> Okay, and that's the riff for the verse as well. It's really simple. I'm just doing a little slide to get to the E. Okay, and the E is on seven on the A string. And then play the open E, uh, the bottom string. Simple as that. Now we want to put the uh, horn part in, which is played on horns on the Blues Brothers um, organ of the Spencer Davis record. I uh, could play this. Okay, and what I'm playing there is an E7 chord. E, B, D, 14, 16, 15, on the D, G and B strings. And just 14, 14, 14 for an A chord. And back to the first chord. Back to the A, and then to an E. And for the E, I like to do a little hammer from the G to the G sharp. So 14, 13, 12. But, but on the uh, G string, do, I like to do that little hammer. I've also got one of those little organ pedals, which makes this quite fun. Get that kind of Spencer Davies sound, okay? And then for the, for the verse itself, nice and simple, we've got the riff. The chorus chords are simply E, G, A, C. Back into the riff. There's also another little guitar lick that you hear on the song. So on there, I'm just playing a B and pull it off to an A and play that twice. Then a little bend on the G on the third fret to an open E. Now, when the verse comes back in the second time around, We've got a little variation, which is nice. We play. Into the chorus there. So what I'm playing there is E, B, E, E, D, sorry. E, D, E, D, E. E. Then the bottom string, the open E. So seven five seven five seven open. And then again seven five seven five seven four five six. C sharp D D sharp go chromatically back up. Then into the chorus. Uh, great fun song to play. If you want to do some noodling like they do at the end, just use the E blues scale. All that kind of stuff. And you can have a lot of fun with this song. Enjoy.